Gator Pit of Texas, Rich Robin here. Brand new Texas Premier Hybrid where you have the hopper and the offset firebox, custom front shelf. It's brand new. What we're doing right now is we're just feeding pellets from the hopper to the fire pot down below. Once we get pellets actually dropping into the fire pot, we're then gonna fire it up on low smoke. And once, after about seven to 10 minutes in low smoke, the smoke will start to dissipate. And then we're going to put it, uh, set it at 225 to season it. I've got some cooking oil. In this case, I got canola spray oil, cooking oil. And once I get the pellets in the fire pot, I'm gonna put the guts into it. The guts being the heat shield over the fire pot, the grease pan, and then the food tray. We'll put that in there. We'll spray everything down with some cooking oil and we'll get this, this thing going and we're gonna season it tonight. This is my son's pit, we're gonna season it tonight and we're gonna start cooking on it. I believe he's gonna do a brisket tomorrow. What you gonna do, Adam? Yeah, I got brisket. You're gonna do a brisket tomorrow, break it in. So that's what we're doing. So again, on a brand new gator pit, pellet hybrid, or even just a pellet, doesn't have to be the hybrid. You're gonna do the same thing when you get this. You're going to take everything out of it. You're gonna fill the hopper up with some pellets or in this case, half a hopper and you're going to hit the feed button, which then actuates the auger. And we got some pellets down here into the fire pot because if you turn it on right now and, and try to get to a temperature, it won't do it because there's nothing to burn. It's like lighting that firebox and there's nothing in there, right? You've got to put some fuel down there, some wood. So once we get pellets dropping right there, we're going to hit the feed button and turn it off. Again, you push it once to turn it on, push it once to turn it off. Once we turn it off, we're then gonna to go to our low smoke mode, which is the top left button right there. And low smoke's gonna get us to, I think, 180 degrees, but we're not gonna wait for that. We're gonna wait for the smoke to dissipate, and then we're gonna hit the plus button to get to 225, and this thing's gonna crank the temp up in the fire pot to get 225. We're just gonna let it run low and slow, and we're gonna put the cooking oil in there and season it, and that's it. That's all you gotta do, guys. If you just had a gator pit without the pellet, you would do the same thing with the firebox. You fire the firebox up, cook and oil it, and let it go for several hours. That's it. It's that simple.